Toyota is struggling to go electric, and that's that's true. But think about it: if you're in the same position, you land that great job, you're making bank, well ahead of all your peers, then you get tapped on the shoulder by your boss, and she says, "Hey, I'd like to take you over to a new division. It's a startup. It's promising, lots of potential, but all you can hear is downside risk." Toyota, the behemoth of the automobile industry, has been selling cars in the United States for over six and a half decades. Their journey in the American market has been characterized by an intense rivalry with auto giants GM and Ford, vying to deliver top-notch, affordable mid-range vehicles and pickup trucks. However, the competition took an interesting turn when Ford unveiled a compact pickup truck that exceeded everyone's expectations, including their own. The demand for a smart and reasonably priced pickup truck was grossly underestimated, and Toyota has finally responded. Join us today as we dive into the rebirth of the Toyota Stout compact pickup, set to rival Ford's Maverick. Toyota has been in the spotlight recently due to their shifting strategy towards electric vehicles and internal combustion engines. Despite the ambiguity surrounding their long-term approach, the automaker is set to re-enter the compact pickup market. For over three decades, Toyota dominated this market with the Helix, which was marketed as a compact and affordable pickup truck. However, they eventually replaced it with the larger Tacoma. Currently, the Tacoma is the best-selling mid-size pickup truck on the market, but Toyota is eyeing the compact pickup segment with the introduction of the new Toyota Stout. The possibility of a new compact Toyota truck was hinted at by Bob Carter, the executive vice president of sales for Toyota Motor North America, and Cooper Erickson, the group vice president of product planning and strategy. Carter stated that Toyota was looking at the compact pickup segment, which includes competitors like the Ford Maverick and the Hyundai Santa Cruz. While they currently have the mid-size pickup market well covered with the Tacoma, Toyota may explore the possibility of a compact pickup in the future. Ericsson added that the upcoming compact pickup might be more suitable for urban driving, suggesting that Toyota is considering using the Toyota new global architecture unibody platform. This platform is known for its flexibility and adaptability to different vehicle types and configurations. However, Ericsson also acknowledged that if there is a demand for a rugged small body frame vehicle, they would consider that as well. Toyota has a long history in the pickup truck market and its entry into the compact truck segment is highly anticipated. The compact truck market is growing with the introduction of the Ford Maverick and the Hyundai Santa Cruz. These new entrants are attracting buyers who are looking for the utility and versatility of a pickup truck, but in a smaller, more fuel-efficient package. Toyota's re-entry into this market could prove to be a smart move, as they have a reputation for building durable and reliable pickup trucks that are well-suited for a variety of tasks. The Toyota Compact Cruiser EV concept has been the inspiration for digital pictures circulating on the internet, created by artist Theodel, which give an idea on what the stout pickup truck could look like. The Compact Cruiser EV is designed to provide a distinctly engaging all-wheel drive EV experience that can improve the lifestyles of young professional urban dwellers with active outdoor leisure hobbies. It incorporates various aesthetic cues from the legendary first-generation Toyota Land Cruiser, such as squared wheel arches, retro-styled white wheels on the left side, simple but powerful body components, and other features that give it an off-road appearance. Although the upcoming stout pickup truck might be more geared toward city driving, it is likely to have some of the same features as the compact Cruiser EV. The stout is expected to have LED lighting elements and an aggressive front fascia, with a chunky side plate, as well as a ladder mounted on the C-pillar and different wheels on the right-hand side. The twin cab design may also be present depending on the version, and the company's Texas-developed infotainment system with a variety of touchscreen sizes inside is also expected to be offered. According to Toyota, the new system has five times as much processing capability as the previous one. The upcoming compact truck's range and specs remain unknown but it must at least match the Maverick specs to compete. The Ford Maverick comes with a standard 2.5-liter four-cylinder engine and an electric motor for support, producing a combined 191 horsepower across all models. A non-hybrid powertrain is also available, featuring a 250-horsepower turbocharged 2-liter four-cylinder engine 
and an 8-speed automatic transmission, with all-wheel drive optional. The Maverick can accelerate from 0 to 60 miles an hour in about 5.9 seconds. The stout truck must match these specs to have a chance of surpassing the Maverick. The Maverick can tow up to 4,000 pounds with the turbocharged four-cylinder engine and the optional towing package. However, we expect Toyota to exceed the Maverick's towing capacity and give the stout towing power similar to the Tacoma. When equipped with rear-wheel drive, the Tacoma can tow up to 6,800 pounds, while it can tow up to 6,500 pounds with four-wheel drive. The stout truck could also be based on the FJ Cruiser, but it's unclear what lies beneath the FJ Cruiser's bodywork. Nonetheless, Toyota's new ETNGA platform, which also underpins the Subaru Solterra and BZ4X, is expected to be present. We anticipate that the compact cruiser will have around 250 horsepower and dual-motor all-wheel drive. The more aerodynamic all-wheel drive BZ4X has a range of 222 miles in its least efficient configuration and is one of the slowest charging EVs on the market. Therefore, it's unlikely to be a ranged or charging champion. As such, we cannot expect the compact cruiser to have an exceptional range or charging capability. One of the key questions in the automotive industry today is whether the new Toyota Stout will be an EV or a hybrid vehicle. As more and more automakers jump on the EV bandwagon, Toyota has been relatively slow to embrace the trend. However, recent reports suggest that the Japanese automaker is finally changing its tune. There is a chance that the new Toyota Stout will be a hybrid truck, as hybrid trucks are gaining popularity, like the Ford Maverick, which will be the Stout's chief rival along with its sister vehicle, the Santa Cruz. In 2022, hybrid vehicles made up around half of the Maverick trucks sold in America. The electrified powertrain lowers the overall cost of the ownership while increasing efficiency. The quick torque of the electric motor, which is useful for towing and uphill driving, as well as the performance appeal of the added power, are other contributions. This new compact truck could be offered as an electric vehicle, hybrid vehicle, or plug-in hybrid vehicle, but the most realistic expectation is a hybrid truck. The Maverick starts at $23,000, while the Tacoma starts at $28,000. So we expect this doubt to start selling somewhere in between those two prices to provide competition for the Maverick. According to the Executive Vice President of Sales for Toyota North America, Bob Carter, the next Toyota pickup truck could be available in 2024 or 2025. He stated that more information about the upcoming compact truck would probably be made public during Toyota's HQ Confidential 3 in July 2023. Ericsson also added, it will be worth the trip. In a recent opinion piece, Toyota CEO Akio Toyota cautioned American media outlets that the current market and infrastructure constraints might prevent the rapid dissemination of EVs and their predicted growth in the upcoming decade from being realized. Toyota instead sought to persuade the world that its slower EV deployment strategy, which continues to develop and sell combustion and hybrid vehicles even as Toyota's full EVs appear, will be a more economical and environmentally friendly course of action. However, no one seems to be listening to Toyota, and they are now lagging behind companies like Tesla, Hyundai, and Ford. Toyota's reluctance to embrace the EV trend has been criticized by many industry experts who believe that the company is missing out on a huge opportunity. With the global automotive industry rapidly moving towards electrification, Toyota needs to step up its game if it wants to remain relevant. Now, Toyota is changing its strategy and pumping in more than $35 billion over nine years for the production of electric and hybrid vehicles. The company has set a target of selling 8 million electrified vehicles per year by 2030. The Toyota Stout will be one of the vehicles that will be rolled out as a result of this change in strategy. Many industry analysts believe that Toyota's focus on hybrids rather than full EVs is a smart move, as it allows the company to leverage its expertise in hybrid technology while also gradually transitioning towards full electrification. Hybrid vehicles offer the best of both worlds, combining the efficiency and eco-friendliness of electric vehicles with the convenience and reliability of gasoline power vehicles. However, it remains to be seen whether consumers will embrace hybrid technology in the long run, or whether full EVs will eventually become the norm. 
While Toyota's strategy may be a more gradual and cautious approach, it could also prove to be more successful in the long run if hybrid technology continues to gain popularity. In any case, the upcoming Toyota Stout is generating a lot of buzz among truck enthusiasts and EV enthusiasts alike. If Toyota can deliver a high-quality, affordable hybrid truck that can compete with the Ford Maverick and other popular trucks on the market, it could be a game-changer for the company. So, this is all we have got for this video. Would you consider purchasing a Toyota Stout that is fully electric or a plug-in hybrid and priced similarly to the Maverick? Let us know in the comments section below this video. If you enjoyed watching this video and would like to stay up to date with the latest news on EVs, Ford, Toyota and technology, please show your support by leaving a like and subscribing to our channel. We will be back to you with another amazing video. Until then, goodbye and peace.